there is a religion that uh, liberates us from our inner tendencies and inner weaknesses and the inner darkness and there is a religion that acts as a toy in the hands of the child right so religion is not one thing but uh, two things really To keep these two distinct, I sometimes call real religiosity as spirituality and the common kind of uh, religion that you referred to as just uh, organized religion. Unfortunately, as uh, would be evident, mostly what we see is a display of the latter kind of religion, uh, where instead of uh, religion being able to grant us uh, the benefit that we so deeply need, it actually becomes a continuation of our uh, immaturity. It actually becomes another bondage uh, on the one who is uh, already in so many chains. The presence of the, the wrong kind of religion uh, should not uh, convince us into thinking that the childish uh, displays of uh, ceremony and hollow superstitions and rituals and practices are all that is there to religion. These are mostly acts of ignorance. You could call these rather as distortions in the spirit of religion. That's not uh, real religiosity. We need real religion. Religion is not uh, just an unnecessary thing foisted uh, on us by, by history, by tradition, by the priests. Religion is a liberating force. True religion pure religion, not the branded kind of religion, not what uh, goes by in the name of religion. Religion is not an unnecessary addition to the long list of problems we already have. If religion is true, it is a solution rather to the core problem that we have.